What's up everybody out there on YouTube land, youtube.com, the community where you get to express who you are if you're making videos, commenting. Okay, that was, that was a dumb intro, but pretty much, what's up? What's going on guys? I am pretty tired right now. You know why? Because I've been doing homework. I just barely finished. I've been doing homework pretty much nonstop besides sleep since like 5 p.m. yesterday. And it was crazy. While um, the only the only breaks I took pretty much were tweeting every now and then saying hey my brother needs X amount of subscribers and and uploading my vlog video and making the vlog video and those are like the only breaks I got and I did it because I needed a little break you know from so much homework um, I've been doing homework all day today I did I finished a bunch of math um, a bunch of English which I'll show you what I did. Or not, because, I mean, I don't have it with me. It's a packet like this big that I had to write, pretty much. Okay, well, I didn't write it. I don't know if I went over this with you guys before, but my English class, my professor, my instructor, she assigned me four people, okay? Everybody. So th there's groups of five, but including me, excluding me, there's only four people, okay? Pretty much, I had to go through each person's essay, which is three to four pages long, and... Mark completely just mark it up with um, editing, you know, critiquing the essay, you know, saying, hey, you know, um, this this is confusing um, during this part of the essay or this narrative. I felt this, and I really liked the way you did that, or I didn't like the way you did that. It made me feel uncomfortable around, while reading it. Any little thing that I can write about the essay that w I think would help the 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 writer, I had to put it in. So I was. Doing that, and that took a while, and after I went ahead and marked all over their, their narratives, what I had to do is I had to write a page a page essay on each of them, critiquing it as well. So, it was like, do numbers 1 through 4, A and B on each. You know, number 1, A, mark up their essay. B, write a, type up a page essay on their essay, critiquing it. It's like, oh man. So I had to do that, and I just finished that like a few minutes ago, maybe, I don't know, not too long ago, and yeah. So that's what I've been up to all day. That, watching a little bit of Futurama. Also, I uh, I went to math class today and took a test, which turned out all right. I don't know. I don't like tests. I, I, I really just don't like tests. I used to be good at them, but now it's like, ah, uh, even the simplest things, I just like brain fart, you know, which just sucks. So don't let that happen to you guys. Don't let that happen to you. Be confident when taking a test, okay? Oh, man. It, it really sucks when you don't feel confident on a test. You know, even though you know the material and you still, for some reason, don't feel at ease while taking it, it sucks. All right, let me see. What else? What else? What else? What else? Um, um, uh, there's really nothing to talk about because that's all I did today. I did homework and, and that stuff, you know, and... Hmm. Okay, I, I need to talk about something else. Hmm. Okay. All right. Um, Dane Cook has a YouTube channel. I didn't know that. I I follow him on Twitter, and he actually posted a link to his. He makes vlog videos. I did not know that. So he vlogs. His YouTube channel is Dane Cook. He's not a partner. He has fourteen thousand subscribers. Which is a pretty low number, com you know, compared to the person who he is. Like he's all, you know, he's pretty popular comedian. He has like million, like a million something uh, Twitter followers. So I'd imagine if he tweeted, "Hey, subscribe to me on YouTube," he would easily rise to the top of the YouTube list. But I don't know. I don't know why he doesn't. But anyways, today he uh, he posted a very interesting video on bullying. And he expresses his opinions on the uh, on the problem of people get uh, people getting bullied around. And I thought it was a pretty good video. You know, you're you're listening to this celebrity guy, comedian, talk about something serious, uh, bullying. You know, and I guess it really hit him because these bullies that are out there right now, there's a lot of bullies. They are forcing people or you know pressuring people to the point where they're going suicidal. And they're killing themselves. So these bullies are killing people. And Dane Cook really just feels really strong about it. And I just think that you guys should go and check him out. YouTube.com slash Dane Cook. And, you know, watch his bully video. So, 
I thought it was really cool to see a comedian talk about something so serious like that. All right, uh, what else? I don't know. I was I was reading some post that MTV is going to release is going to um, feature some new gaming console or MTV uh, gaming console or gaming hardware, something that they're going to uh, release, and it's weird. I don't know what what it's all about, but something is going to be announced, some kind of gaming hardware. I was really surprised, you know, because MTV is going to show. It's like, okay, that doesn't make any sense. Let me see, MTV to to um, announce gaming hardware or something. I don't know if it's hardware, if it's software, or what. Um, and it's supposedly by a major company. I, I don't know. But anyways, I thought that was pretty interesting. MTV gaming hardware. Um, report new gaming hardware to be revealed on MTV tonight. I don't know. That's how I was. Re I was reading the website um, Kotaku.com. Report new gaming hardware revealed today via MTV. According to the, a major consumer's electronics company, will unveil a new gaming co related product today, um, and they'll do it, and they'll do so tonight via MTV. Um I don't know. I'm going to have to I'm pretty tired so I'm probably going to go to sleep, but I'll check it out tomorrow and you know, see what all the hype was about. I don't know if it's like uh, Microsoft or Sony or or Samsung or someone trying to get into the market of gaming. But we'll see. Gaming is a very large market nowadays. I think making way more money than than theaters these days more than movies because gaming has has that replay value. A movie, oh, I've seen this many times. Oh, uh, this is the this is the line they're going to say. But if a game, for example, I play games for the online play. I play FPS, so I play. It's different all the time because you're playing against other people. And nowadays the AI is so smart, they don't always do the same exact thing. You know, just video games is is a big thing nowadays. It's it's taken over the entertainment industry like by far. Um, there was actually a study I was looking up a long like I didn't look it up but it came up a long time ago that now nowadays more couples are looking into getting video games. Now they're not hardcore gamers, but they like casual games. For the Wii example, for example, they would get Mario Party um, just because you know it's something fun for the whole family. You know, and it's something new, and it's like a board game. It's a virtual board game. It has tons of replay value. Instead of, instead of, so they buy that game for 50, 60 bucks. Instead of buying three, four DVDs, which they will, which repeat over and over and over, and they'll get bored of. I know my family here, we have loads of DVDs, and we don't even watch them. Okay? We don't even watch them. I'm over here on Netflix instead. Um, I don't know. I've just watched my DVDs so many times. You know, just the replay value just decreases every time you watch a video a movie anyways that's all i really have to say today guys um i'm tired obviously i can't really get my words straight can't really think right ah <sighs> the word critique is all through my head because the essays crazy stuff just want to thank you guys once again for subscribing to my brother's youtube channel he is extremely thankful. I wonder if he's over there. He is extremely thankful, and I mean, this is really good thing for him. I'm happy for you, Sean, if you're watching this video. Happy for you. Wish you all the success on your channel. Um, just keep making videos, man. Just keep making videos. Do your thing. I'm pretty sure people will like your personality. You know, once you once you get comfortable in front of the camera, because seriously, my brother's a funny guy. He's a funny guy, and you guys may notice like similarities between me and him. That's because you know. As brothers, we're pretty close, I would say. And we spend a lot of time together, especially online playing. So, I mean. He's over there probably listening to me. Huh. Huh, Sean, you're listening to me, huh? Yeah, he can hear me. Anyways, so, I mean, good luck, Sean, with your channel. Everybody, thank you for subscribing. He reached, like, over 100 subscribers in less than 24 hours. Yeah, there he is. There he is. You can't even see him. It's so dark over there. My light doesn't shine as far. 
I, I knew you heard me. Nah. No, yeah. Let's work on my next <laughs> vlog video. Oh, you forgot to say your name in. Oh, I forgot to say my name in. For my vlog video, number two. This is Super Sonic. <laughs> okay, so I guess he. Yeah. I, I continued my video. Continued his video, his video. on my video. Alright, well, I'm gonna see you guys later. Peace. Yeah. Bye.